number five is Tom Hanks' 1988 massive cult classic, Big. The brands, The Walking Piano by Remo Saraceni and F.A.O. Schwartz. What department did you say you were in? Oh, I'm in computers. Computers? Yeah. <laughs> Just say for you took it to chips. Okay, so Big may not technically be a holiday movie, but it does take place in New York City during Christmas time. And the plot does revolve around toys, a lot of toys. So it came in for us at number five on our list. Who could possibly forget the piano scene where Tom Hanks and Robert Logie is? Okay, uh, let's check out. At number four is my husband's own very favorite film. And we never miss rewatching it each and every year. That movie, in 1946, It's a Wonderful Life. And the brand, why, that would be National Geographic. It's a Wonderful Life is perhaps one of the most popular Christmas movies of all time. And it has been cherished by so many generations. What, Mary? What do you want? You, you want the moon? Just say the... At number three is a film that I worked on for product placement and promotional partnerships back in 2003. And in fact, I still have a little toy takeaway that the production team gifted me that I pull out every year. It's one of my favorite holiday films I've worked on, and it is... Wait for it. Will Ferrell's Elf. Passion fruit spray? Fruit spray? Sure. The movie coming in second as a holiday favorite movie with product placement, and that has come to mind with giving brands some extra holiday love, is a 1990 franchise starter of a hit, Macaulay Culkin's Home Alone. <laughs> This is my house. I have to defend it. Where's your mother? My mom's in the car. Where's your father? He's and then that brings us to the number one holiday film with some product placement you are sure to remember, 1983's A Christmas Story. And the brand? Well, for me, there are two that come to mind instantly. The first, the radio flyer Red Wagon, something I had myself as a child, and the official Red Rider Carbon Action. 200 shot range model air rifle, the must have for many a child in days long past. And all of those product placements I've mentioned cost less than one single 30 second ad spot in prime time. 